today's gig has us in workshop so not too far again just the other side of sheffield just popped into the studio to get the guitars need to get a few cables need to pack away my in-ears but got plenty of time today don't need to start for a good few hours yet so I might just chill here in the studio Oh, and by the way, I've learnt my lesson from the terrible footage that you had to witness in the last few vlogs from the iPhone. So I'm going to be taking this Sony with me and getting good, crispy 4K so your eyeballs aren't subjected to the absolute garbage that you had to see in the last few. Okay, so I've got everything I need from the studio. It's time to head out and pack the car and get set off for the gig. Let's go. On the way to tonight's gig, another self-contained gig, this time in Worksop. So we got all the gear with us again. About an hour and a half to this one. An hour. an hour. So not too bad at all. Was a bit of stress we didn't have quite as long as we thought we were going to have we had to get in set up and sound checked in half an hour but we've managed it it's all done it's sounding pretty good so backstage gonna get warmed up get the guitars ready get changed we show time <coughs> jesus oh, sorry. oh and i cut myself while setting up on stage perfect just what you want before a show So just off stage after the first set, we've got to do three sets tonight, which usually I don't enjoy, but because it's so hot tonight on stage, it's actually a bit of a blessing because the guitars are really struggling to stay in tune because the heat is so bad on stage and then they put the AC on halfway through the show, halfway through the first set, so it started to cool down, which made it even worse. So I'm constantly tuning and things are going out of tune all the time, but it's just, it's fine. So we've got about half an hour to chill back here, then on for the second one. Then about an hour after that one, I think. Oh. Yeah, about an hour after the second set. And then on to the third one. And I had to take the plasters off my finger because I just could not play with the plasters on because I couldn't feel the guitar neck at all. And so obviously it started bleeding as soon as I started playing. So I got blood all on the back of the neck and it made it all sticky and gross. But 
Got to fight through these things. Second one done. It's all happening tonight though. Halfway through the set my wah got stuck on. Even though it was off. The lights were off. So I banged the treadle on, the lights came on, and it went all the way down to toe down position. Rolled it back off, banged it off, lights went off, and it seemed to be okay. So don't know what that was about. Other than that, it had cooled down in the venue when we first went on, so the guitars were all out of tune. And now it's warmed right back up again and I'm dripping with sweat. Done. Three sets. Done. It got really warm again in there. Yeah. The disadvantage of doing it in three, I find, is that you, you just kind of get in going into those sets and then you have to stop and then you have to warm back up again when you get back on stage and then you have to stop. And then, especially for the third one, we had so long to wait and then you go back on and everything's cold and you need to warm back and get back into it. It's, but it's bingo the is the most important thing okay. and that's what comes first. That might be a bit of a foreign concept to some of you, but in England, the club scene that a lot of us end up doing, you do kind of end up playing second fiddle to bingo, bingo rules all, so. And football. And football tonight, yeah. mm -hmm. Good crowd though, full room. They seem to really mm -hmm. enjoy it, so that was all good. Just gotta pack it all down. Yay!